I will be recommending to the school board to delay the start of the 2020-21 school year for students by two weeks. Hillsborough Superintendent Addison Davis says he does not want to see schools reopen now until August 24th. Do you think that it's a reasonable ask delay by a couple weeks? I think it's a reasonable ask. I mean, there are a lot of things to weigh out. The district is now partnering with Tampa General Hospital and USF Health to review its reopening plans. Every minute our plans are fluid. We have to be flexible and we have to be able to create innovative educational models to serve our children. And there are several models, including back to school as normal, but with health changes, a hybrid rotation blending in classroom and e-learning, and a totally virtual option for families who would prefer that. Listen to teachers. But as COVID cases climb, calls continue to completely scrap an in-person start to the school year. Teachers protested Wednesday outside the State Education Commission meeting at Strawberry Crest High School in Dover. Students are going to get sick. Teachers are going to get sick. We can go back when the numbers drop. Until then, several important questions remain largely unanswered, like what happens to the rest of a class if a teacher or student winds up testing positive? Yeah, I think what the department's doing is working with the State Department of Health and then obviously each district working with their county health department um, on those protocols. And as we know, even though I, I you know, I believe that the, the younger kids in particularly, um, you know, seem to be more resistant to this. Uh, the fact is, um, you know, you're probably going to see see different uh, uh, different transmission um, as, as this stuff goes.